this is debasis misra so today we will discuss a very important topic that is what is the pass mark and fail mark of dpt semester and internal examination so main tum log ko batana chahta hu tumhara dost log ko ye video bhejo ye very important video hai theek hai so tum log fast semester ho fifth semester ho third semester ho seventh ya eighth ho jo bhi semester ho wo sabke liye important hai main pura detail mein data लेकर पूरा तुमको बताया हूँ पूरा वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट चीज़ है ठीक है अगर कुछ डाउट है तो कमेंट करके बताओ मैं पूरा तुमको क्लैरिफिकेशन करके बता दूंगा मैं पूरा ट्राई किया हूँ इस वीडियो में तुमको क्लैरिफिकेशन करके बताने के लिए अगर फिर भी कुछ डाउट है फिर तुम मुझे कमेंट करके बताओ मैं तुमको क्लैरिफिकेशन कर दूंगा ठीक है न्यू है तो जरूर सब्सक्राइब कर लेना ठीक है चलिए शुरू करते हैं फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट द इंटरनल then after you will go to the semester so all of you to know that your internal examination now it is 50 previously it was 30 now it is converted to 50 and your semester examination is 100 marks previously it was 70 70 30 full mark was 100 now it is 100 and 50 150 mark okay so i will detail tell you internal evaluation is 50 mark assignment is 5 mark surprise test is 5 mark quiz test is 10 mark class test 1 and class test 2 which is called internal exam 30 mark total is 50 mark and your pass mark is 50% that means 25 mark is pass mark okay so now you clear your internal examination that means that is the hand of your college your college teacher will send 50 mark pass mark is 25 clear students then we will go to the semester examination so clearly i have given you o grade is 90 and above up to 100 means 90 if you have scored 90 then from 100 then it is o grade that means 90 and up to 100 90 to 100 82 less than 90 means 89 82 to 89 is e grade 70 to 79 is a grade 60 to 69 is b grade 50 to less than 60 59 it is c grade 37 to 49 it is d grade below 37 then what is your pass mark is 37 is your pass mark okay below 35 you will fail another important point is here grade c shall be considered as average and grade d shall be pass grade for theory and grade c shall be the pass grade for practical sessional project seminar by papers so for your theory exam d grade is pass for for your practical sessional project and seminar by papers c grade is pass c grade means 50 above and 60 less okay 62 less means 59 52 59 is your pass grade all of you clear then in internal 25 mark is pass in semester exam 37 mark is pass then you see total mark pass mark is 37 plus 25 it is 62 from 150 so if you score 62 from 150 your paper will be clear then another important point i will tell you suppose suppose you score 62 or more than 62 in semester examination but you score 20 mind this point 20 in your internal examination then you are failed otherwise if you score 50 to 49 in internal and you score 20 in your semester examination that means almost 70 you scored you will also fail that means you have to score 37 plus mark in your semester examination 25 plus mark in internal examination total you have to score 62 okay over not overall you have to 37 in semester 25 in minimum minimum 37 minimum 25 in clear all of you clear if you any doubt just comment me i will make you understand then what is the o grade what is the mark for o grade 135 to 150 mark is your o grade e grade is 120 to 
A grade is 105 to 119. B grade to 90 to 104. C grade is 75 to 89. D grade is 60 to 74. So if you score less than 62, it will be considered as fail mark. Okay, now clear. Very important video. Please share with your friends. It will definitely help them. So thank you students. Please like, share and subscribe my channel.